Hey, what's up everybody? This is Blackpo, and today we're talking about monitors. I had a couple people since the review came out, they upgraded the computer. I'm very excited for them, and I just wanted to help out with more stuff for your computer that's going to help you in your games and give you the upper advantage. So, I will be right back and we'll get going on this. Alright, this is my main monitor that I use. Um, it is an ASUS. This is a gaming monitor. This right here is going to be your most important number. This um, is a one millisecond refresh rate, which is excellent, great on, um, I mean, as far as I'm concerned, best you can get on the market, uh, your refresh rates right here of the actual monitor. And this is a 1080 monitor. It's not 4K, but I looked at the 4K one that ASUS had in the millis, um, the refresh rate was four milliseconds, so um, I was advised just to go ahead with the 1080. So I would have a faster refresh rate to give me the upper advantage. It's a 24 inch screen on here, and the import is for HDMI. So um, those are going to be your two most important things when getting a monitor. If you don't know anything, well, too much about it. Is going to be real for refresh rate and what kind of inputs you have because they do have different kind of inputs and you got to make sure that your NVIDIA can fit them. So this is a 3D screen and you can move around the screen and set it up exactly how you want it. There's a three-year warranty that already comes on the monitor itself. That is not through Best Buy, that's through ASUS. You can buy this at Best Buy. The link will be in the description for you if you would like it. I'm thinking, don't quote me on the cost, but I think that it's around 250 So um, let me show you on the monitor and give me one second. This is going to be the ASUS monitor right here. Um, it doesn't come with a webcam, but you can buy those at Best Buy as well. I will show you all those. Actually, they're super, super cheap. But um, let me just turn this on real fast and give you an idea of what's going on here. Um, as I said, you can turn it. It turns on the, um, on the monitor. It goes up, up. Uh, it goes down, so it it spins and wiggles for you and stuff. Um, this is this is your monitor. I mean, y'all seen this monitor? It's pretty. It's pretty fresh. Um, it's not bad graphics at all. So um, let me show y'all the other monitor. This is my other monitor right here. It's not a fancy monitor. I just use it to Twitch and do YouTubing and my guides and stuff while I play my game on my. Um, gaming monitor so as you can see from this it's still an HD screen you can see the inputs right here it does not have an HDMI input it's either um, the DVI or the VGA um, for example you're going to want to know that because my my um, my the video only takes two HDMI cables and one DVI cable in it I believe it's DVI um, it's a 19 0.5 screen you can pick this up at Walmart this will be in the description also it's only $70 so if you're in a little crunch then um then you can get some this monitor is fairly nice it's not as great as the other monitor but it's still really good um, let me show you all the sides here and right here you can see the response time right here um, response response time five milliseconds so um, that's still pretty good when it comes to um, games. Um, it's not as great as one millisecond, but as far as I was told, um, most of my info I'm getting from Best Buy, which if y'all do have questions, um, Geek Squad at Best Buy does help out a whole lot. Um, they've, they've helped me out a great amount. Um, he told me that anything over five milliseconds is respectable but you really want to get under three so um just an idea for y'all and i'll show y'all the computer and um the monitor in just a second and this is going to be the acer monitor from walmart there's no webcam on it um but the the graphics on it are pretty decent they're not as great as the other one but it is really good um y'all give me a second 
I'll show you all my setup here and then we're going to look at the back of the computer and I'll show you all how to set up two monitors right now. So this is my setup. Um, as you can see, the screens are on both of my both of my screens and I can move the mouse between them. Um, let me show you all the back of the computer and show you all how to hook this up. Alright, this is going to be the back of your NVIDIA. I have a MSI NVIDIA. You can see the cut in right there. Uh, still great NVIDIA. Um, as you can see, this is one of my imports. This is the other one. And this is your other HDMI. I wouldn't recommend hooking more than um, two monitors to one NVIDIA um, card. If you want to go up to three monitors, I really would get a second NVIDIA because every monitor that you hook up is going to be pulling on your NVIDIA. So if you hook up three monitors, you're really going to be downsizing your NVIDIA trying to keep all three of those screens open. So um, we're going to go into the screen, um, the computer, and I'm going to show you how to set this up. All you do is you plug in your two computers. Very, very simple. This is the one to the ASUS straight into HDMI, and this is one from the ASUS straight into DVI. Um, I believe this is the DVI one. So I will be right back, and we're going to go on screen, and I'll show you all the last parts, very simple, very easy. After you get back onto the main screen, right click, go to display settings, and it's going to show this right here. You're going to hit identify, and it will show the numbers on one. You can't see the other computer right now, but the other computer says two. And land them up the way you want. At first, man, it's like this. And I didn't think that it worked, <laughs> but I need to be like this. And my computer screen is smaller, so I have to put, like, how I drag over, which I got mine set up to where the Acer would be in the dead center of the suit, so I have to slide over right here. If I slide over right here, it kind of snags and doesn't want to go. So, after that, you just hit apply. Um, make sure when you're on number one, you click, um, well, on the ASUS computer, this is my main display, and then hit apply, and everything will be good to go. And then you have two monitors right there. Um, three, I'm not absolutely sure I don't have three monitors, so it may get a little bit more in-depth. But um, anyway, I hope this helped. All these um, links will be in the description for the ASO computer from Walmart and the Asus from Best Buy. I hope this video really helped y'all. And make sure you subscribe for a few more um, review videos. I got some RAM cards I want to show off to y'all. Um, my, um, my mouse and keyboard and webcam I want to show to y'all because they're super, super cheap. And... Some people I'm hearing are spending like a hundred dollars for a mouse and the monitor that well the mouse that I'm getting costs little to nothing and it's one of the best mouses that I've ever had. But anyway, um and send me comments on um your feedback and what you think about it. Alright, um thanks for watching and this was Black Poe.